All right, y'all, check it. So this man right here, John Chang, I showed you him in a video a couple months ago of him displaying the true spiritual powers that are attained through daily meditation, like meditation, deep meditation, every single day. Um, check this book out, The Magus of Java. This man trained under him, and I mean, they get into so many different things. Like We're not going to cover it now, but I just want you to remember that this is why... There are beings on the earth that are attempting to poison you through chemtrails, the food, I mean, all kinds of different ways. You see what I'm saying? It's not a game. Understand that your body is made of the elements and that you are the supreme being. You see what I'm saying? Indeed, all the elements are contained within you. You are the elements. So here you can see. I used to look at these charts back in the day and I'd be like, man, what the heck were they trying to tell you? I, I got the part of the chakras, like the mandalas or whatever, showing you the chakras riding up the spine, but like the little people and all that. But think about it. That's the microbiome. Like I've been telling y'all the probiotics, the prebiotics, the enzymes, you see what I'm saying? They were hip to all this stuff way back in antiquity, y'all. A lot of that stuff we were not taught about growing up. So best know that there is an agenda to keep you in the dark about that. And like, look at this chart here, how it shows you the different animal bodies. All the different bodies are contained within you. That's why you're the supreme being. Because yes, even in the human being, there are many parts from animals. Like you have a reptilian brain. You see what I'm saying? That's inside of you. You see what I'm saying? Like you're, you're a cosmos. So you contain every single form of life that you can think of within you. And that's what these different charts were attempting to show you, you know, and a lot of the times this stuff is perverted as, oh, scary and spooky, the occult, you know, but man, we break it down over here and we ain't playing games. We ain't scared of the knowledge. We face it head on. So this is what I do. And um, I know a lot of y'all rocking with me. This is what y'all do. So this video right here, we're just going to get into a little bit of the occult symbolism, you know, like this is us. This is nothing scary. This is you. This is the human body. This is us. And then I want you to understand why there's so much warfare on you, because when you get an activated human being, someone who's able to manipulate the chi from their body, man, you can't control a being like that. <laughs> Picture that all of us running around doing that, man, they can't have that. You see what I'm saying? So you best believe that's why they got chemtrails in the air and why they're trying to always hit you with all kinds of different chemical and biological weapons. You know, like white sugar, you know, uh, that's a clinically labeled as a poison, but it's in all kinds of foods. You see what I'm saying? Like, so, I mean, you can't tell me that I'm tripping. I mean, just think about it. You know, like how this sun right here and the moon on one side, the conscious and the unconscious. You see what I'm saying? What you're conscious of and what you're not conscious of, that affects you. You see what I'm saying? Like real rap and understand that you are the tetragrammaton. You see what I'm saying? There's a toroidal feel around your body, a conscious living bioelectrical magnetic feel around you. And so anyway, getting forward at this, right? You got to understand that your pH, you want to keep that around the 7.4, 7.6. Like I've been telling y'all for a while, I got the test strips. You can get them off Amazon, 1299. I went into that. Um, and you know that pH scale is very important because when your body's pH is off, you're susceptible to being more sick. You see what I'm saying? All kinds of things can go wrong with you. Like I told you, you want to get your probiotics. You want to get the prebiotics because the prebiotics is what feeds the probiotics. The probiotics is the microscopic organisms, a good bacteria. This what you're looking at now, that's a picture of the enzymes, just one type of enzymes. There's many types of enzymes, amylase, lipase. Um, these different enzymes all have different functions and are featured in different parts of the body. If you want me to touch on that, I can touch more into that because I, you know, I got some knowledge on that too, or whatever. And um, so going forward, I just want you to understand, like I showed you the periodic table that see all these different elements are contained within your body. You see what I'm saying? Every single one of them, the hydrogen being the number one is what everything is built off of. And then, you know, you have all these different vitamins and minerals that make up your body. I mean, this is real stuff. And if you're not getting this stuff in your system, no wonder you feel like trash. No wonder, you know, you can't get up and do anything. You can't focus. See what I'm saying? You got too much sugar in the body. I mean, look at the body systems. I mean, look at this. I mean, like, think about every time you take a drink of alcohol or you smoke a cigarette or something and breathing in these toxins from these cars, what that's doing 
understand that you are the most advanced technology in the cosmos, family. The most advanced technology. So next time you look at one of them robots, they're showing you doing all these tricks and flipping and jumping. Man, remember, they got that from you. You see what I'm saying? Just like the cameras, the reverse engineering of your eye, the hair, the antennas. You see what I'm saying? It's reverse engineering of you. So look at this. Your digestive system, the muscular system. I mean, look at that. The lymphatic system, the endocrine system, the nervous system. I mean, it just goes on and on and on, man. <laughs> Yo, and it's not a game. Think about that. All these different parts that are layered in you. You see what I'm saying? You got worlds within worlds. Remember, rings within rings. That's you. You see what I'm saying? I'm not playing games with y'all, man. I'm trying to, you know, uh, wake you up here. To, like, man, wake up to what and what you truly are. You see what I'm saying? Like, yo, you're magnificent. Don't ever let anybody tell you that you're not magnificent, man. You were created in the image of the supreme. <laughs> like, fact. <laughs> I can't make it up, man. I mean, it's just gorgeous when you really think about what goes into the human body. It's beautiful. And then, you know, it's sad that we sit up here and we destroy it, especially those of us who got good health, like myself. I'm shooting myself in the foot here, you know, all them years you know, drinking all the alcohol. Think about that. That hot liquor going into all these little veins and ventricles you got going on, man. It can't be good. That hot, you know, uh, liquid sitting in there and the pink fleshy stuff bubbling and oozing, you know, like, man, the grease and stuff that we eat with chicken and all this stuff. You know, it's like, it's crazy some of the things that we do to our body and we don't even realize what we're doing, you know, it's really sad, but you can wake up and like I said, it's not too late, man. You can regenerate these organs. Like I told y'all about the colon cleanse or whatever, like when I did the two colon cleanses, like even when I did the first one, I could tell a difference. I only made it four out of the five days that first one, but I could tell a difference in my digestive system. Like um, my stomach wasn't cramping as much. Instead of me going to the bathroom once a day, I started going twice a day. You see what I'm saying? Then eventually after I did my next one, I'm going three times a day sometimes, sometimes twice. But you want to you wanna go at least twice. You know, like, no, you never want to skip a day because that's what your colon, right, is responsible for eliminating the waste along with the liver and other parts too. Now, don't get me wrong, but the colon is a larger organism. So if you can at least get that colon cleanse in, I'm telling you, your body is going to feel it. You see what I'm saying? Like, And look at how important the muscles are. Think about that, how important it is to exercise. If one of those little muscles in the neck goes out, can't hold your neck up see what i'm saying one of the little muscles in the face goes out your cheek drooping you know what i'm saying like it's very important and uh you know like look at that right there like what i like to call the third eye system the pituitary gland the hypothalamus and the pineal gland all three of those together you know that's what i like to call the third eye system but i mean like it's crazy how a lot of the spiritual um uh organs or whatever are you know right here like on this chart like and it shows you like man like dang like it correlates to the chakras is what i'm trying to say excuse me it's just amazing man like we really need to be conscious of what it is that we're doing with our bodies it's really not a game like you know your nervous system think about it when you drink alcohol how it depresses that you know that stops you from feeling doesn't alcohol deaden you from pain should i drink more than enough of it so i know <laughs> you ain't gotta tell me twice like it deadens you to pain i mean look at what it's doing look at how that runs throughout your system that's why you feel the way you feel the next day you know you feel trashy man this is how it is I mean, check it out. Even like, you know, Yogananda, you know, like he was putting us on. Like, you think that they was putting all this time into the spiritual centers and stuff. Uh, real places in the body. Now, you can see the Muradhara correlates to the coccygeal. You see what I'm saying? Swadhisthana to the sacral, Manipura to the lumbar. These are real places in the body. So they were putting all this spiritual knowledge into all these different places of the body with the real parts of the body just playing? Hell no, man. Who plays like that? Nobody plays like that. I'm not sitting up here playing with you. See right here in this diagram, you can see where it says sacral nerves, where it says lumbar nerves. Ain't that the exact same spot that it was just shown in the other diagram? That's what I'm saying. Like, it's not a game, y'all. We're not playing, man. Like, I like to demystify stuff, the mist around it. Let's get rid of that. You know what I'm saying? Yo, wholeness to secret energy and seven bow markers. He put me on to a lot of this stuff and got me, you know, woke awoke to a lot of this stuff. Like, man, hold on. A lot of this stuff ain't what they're saying it is. But, and then here I want to finish out, y'all. You know, wholeness to the late, great Dr. Sebi. 
102 minerals that make up the body. Remember, I told y'all sh between shilaji and sea moss, you know, you could pretty much cover all those. But I mean, it's so many of them. Y'all look at aluminum, Americanum, at at antimony, <laughs> argon. That's one of the um, that's one of the nat uh noble elements actually, like the monatomics. You know, and I got a place I can put y'all onto that too. I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all done heard of that before. But I mean, look at it. It's so many of them: neon, nickel, nitrogen, xenon, zinc, uranium, tungsten, titanium. Yo, I'm telling you, man, it's really not a game. You are a cosmos. The micro of the macro. Understand that, y'all. You are a cosmos, an entire cosmos. From the Kundalini coming out of the Cossacks all the way to the Crown Chakra, Shahasharara. Understand, yo. Understand. You are the supreme being. Wholeness.